Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Jack 2, the HD collection. Last we left off, we left off there. Yeah, that's right. I can't say I remember so well. Woke up like eight hours ago. How can you expect me to remember after waking up so early, you know? Nah, I'm messing with you. Gotta go through these damn sewers because crew is a douchebag. Ah, I wonder if the metalhead jumps out at you from the gate a second time. No? No, okay. It would have still been nice. Oh, well, I never knew that those fish, whatever they are down there, actually, were down there. Uh, of course, we just get the jet board, now we get something to test it out with makes perfect sense. Oh, this is pretty cool. They should have put in a few more of these. I don't think there's any more of these in the game. I know you have to use your jet board plenty in the game. I don't know. I wonder how many parts this let's play is going to be. Oh, great. Here's a gimmick. Bombs drills, and both together. If a bomb and a drill bred, would that be like a redneck baby for non-living items? I mean, if, if it could happen, obviously it can't, but if it could, would that be like a machine's form of a redneck baby? I don't know, some questions like that just plague you at night. No, I think we've got it completely lowered. No? Yeah, I think that's about as low as it'll go. <laughs> ah, and now they have these things, whatever those are. Why are there spikes protruding from the ground in the sewers? Is it trying to stab lurking crocodiles in here? Alligators can actually live in the sewers. I thought I mentioned that. It was proven before. Okay, no, the water can totally be lower. Yeah. But there is totally proof of alligators being found in the sewer before. It's kind of like that urban city myth that people talk about. Like, the country myth is people go cow tipping. Honestly, I've never been cow tipping. And I would fail at it because drop kicking a cow is totally illegal, I think. I think. And I think it might wake up if I drop kick it. That and there would be a lot of force in that kick. I'm not exactly a small guy. If yes, too bad you don't get like random point bonuses just for doing front flips out of random and back flips. And do we have to go back here? No, I think we just continue. I don't know. Whenever they don't give you the mini map, I get so lost. It's like, should I be going this way when they have two paths? It's like, ah. Statue. Oh, look, there's a key. Oh, that is a nice ruby. Whoa! Got it. Where would you be without me, eh, Dax? Well, Jack, I probably wouldn't be two feet tall, fuzzy, and running around in a sewer without a pair of pants. God, I miss pants. <laughs> I bet he does. I, I bet he gets pretty drafty down there. Now, think about it. That would that would probably get cold, you know. A fan starts blowing on you. Gets a little cold. Eh. Poor Daxter. Poor Daxter. Hmm. I haven't actually been in the sewers before, but I doubt it looks this mechanically complex. I mean, I could be wrong. But I doubt it. I've seen videos in the su of sewers before. It, w it was commentaries on finding something, though. Uh, I like those. The let's go find the mythical animal thing. Uh, hold on. Oh, where, where are we going? Where are we going? The red thing is close by. Um. 
I guess we'll just go to that. And it's closer than Torrin's place. What the hell is that? something I don't like in video games in general, and I'm sure so many people could agree with me on it. Hold on, we're gonna. How's it riding in the hood, Red? Get out of the area. This is Crimson Guard business. One of Vin's eco tankers is coming in from the wasteland, but the clearance transmission sounded fishy. The driver was scared. We're going to check it out just in case. How can we help? I've got it handled. Yeah, you look like you really got shit in. Ah, a metal head sneak attack! Damn! It's just us! Help me take out all the metal heads! Get them all! No, oh, you got a handle, so help you. Oh, I like how that one crimson guard right there is just sitting down watching metal heads invade the city. Not like that's the ultimate threat or something that they're always complaining about. I still want to know why after you hit one of these things once they start running on their hind legs. Payback's a bitch. Speaking of, do you want a short person to run so fast? Alright, let's, let's use that power. I like that power. Like shooting. Ooh, no, I wasn't done collecting. We got them all. The metalheads are getting bolder every day. It's almost like they're testing our defenses, like probing attacks. I've got a bad feeling about this. Yeah, you're welcome. Oh, my bad, I hit my mic. Ah, oh, well, some, some more dark eco doesn't sound bad. Some skull gems. I think there's a trophy for collecting 500 or so of them. I think that's a gold one, so I'm after that one. I don't know if I'm going to check my trophies list during the Let's Play. Uh, that's a little unprofessional. Nah, yeah, might not. Gotta stop talking about my damn trophies though. Playing Jack 2 right now, which only slightly involves the trophies. Where's a zoomer? A zoomer is faster than this thing. Where, where's one at? Dun 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 dun. Alright. There's so much air traffic. Hover traffic. I don't even know what kind of traffic this is. Just I'm gonna stick to traffic. I wonder what Torn needs us to do. Probably some shitty mission. Again. I want you boys to escort the kid over to Core at the power station. He promised to look out for the boy, and I'm just too busy to babysit right now. Oh, and take the kid's crocodile with you. Oh, isn't he sweet? So what's this kid's story? I found him just wandering the streets, but that amulet around his neck means he may just be the lost heir to the city. Take the kid and the mutt to the power station. Watch out for guard patrols and defend the kid at all costs. Oh, and uh, if you happen to lose the crocodile. <laughs> hey, kid! Yeah. Wait! I Come doubt the crocodile's going me. anywhere. The Baron wants every kid uh -oh. city around. Too bad you don't actually see the crocodile in Jack 3. Or if you do, I, I don't know. Yes, the crocodile's like. An in game mascot to Naughty Dog's uh, mascot. I forgot what the dog's name is though. I think it's in the credits. It should be. If I remember Spanish Ducks, let's play right though. A name for the Naughty Dog's so Naughty Dog is actually in the credits. Jack seems a little pissed at the Crimson Guard are trying to mess up with the kid. Dude, whoa, 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 whoa. Stick with me, kid, and you'll be safe. Crimson's guards have horrible aim right now. 
I wonder if they get like better aim as the story progresses. I hope not. Because there's already enough of them. Don't even team cook out. Hold on! Oh, they got like a full house right here in the car. Hover car. God, these things are aggravating me. Actually, speaking of hover cars, a hover car was built like an actual hovering car was built a long time ago. Like, at, at least eight plus years ago. I remember hearing about it. And they said it was built but the how expensive it is to make, they said it wouldn't even be available for common use within people for at least 100 years. So uh, if I live really long, I might see the day where those start to get a little common on the street, which I doubt. But hell, whatever. Now we just gotta get up to Ben's place right here. I know this part of the city by heart. I played enough Jack 3 to remember this damn place. Crocodile is fast. I don't even want to know how a crocodile and dog bred either. What, what's up with this game? An awkward creature's breeding. Samos has Kira as his daughter. Only God knows what her Samos' wife or drunken lover is. Metalheads, I don't even want to know what conceives metalheads. I know they're all born in eggs, but what the hell lays the egg? I, I don't even think I want to know. There's a crocodile right here. Um, do I have to walk with you? Yes, I do. Let's get these two to call. <sighs> Samus told us to bring the kid to you. Thank you. I'll be sure to keep him close. <laughs> oh, sweet. <laughs> Interesting. That insufferable mutt never liked anyone but the boy before. I guess I'm just good with animals. I hope we have enough eco to keep the metalheads at bay. During my travels in the deep wasteland, I saw some of the bigger ones. Awesome creatures. We saw a big one coming out of a rift once. He was ugly! <laughs> I have some valuable information for you. The Baron is conducting an excavation at the dig. He is still looking for that ridiculous tomb. Frankly, I don't believe it exists, but you might as well go out there and disrupt his operation just in case. Knock down all the scaffolding at the site. That should set him back. Here is an air train pass to get you out there. Hmm. Wow, 13 minutes went by already? That that was fast. I honestly uh, didn't even notice the time went by. Oh yeah, let's let's hit a crimson guard on the way out. Just it's it's the right thing to do. So uh, I guess we're going there next. Great, great. But that's gonna be on next part because we're running out of time. Yeah, that about seems right. So thank you guys for watching and see you next time. Bye.